Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hey Bartender. My name is Gustavo Rojas, your personal bartender, and today we have another delicious cocktail. Yes, probably you see the Campari, you see the little sweet vermouth. We're talking about the Negroni, but this is gonna be a really nice fancy variation. So stay with me, and we're gonna make this twist of the Negroni in El Desahogo Mezcal. Let me show you how it's done here in Hey Bartender. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna be doing this uh, really cool variation of the, one of the classics. Uh, 1919 in Florence, Italy, they start making the Negronis. That's one of the amazing things that actually Italy create for all of us, the people that we love classic cocktails. Uh, this one is gonna be a really cool variation of it. And we're gonna make it with uh, Mezcal El Desahogo from Matatlan, which is actually a really, really good uh, Mezcal for all of you guys that are introducing into the world of tasting Mezcal. Uh, once again, I always recommend you guys, make sure that you, if you go for the first bottle that you're purchasing of mezcal, that's gonna be your first, first time that you're gonna be making cocktails or mezcal by itself. You wanna try the 39% proof, which is something really nice and smooth like this guy. All right, so how are we gonna make this guy? Very simple. We're gonna start with a little bit of a forest rosemary and we're gonna put them in our mixer glass. Then we're gonna go for one ounce and a quarter or for Spadding Coven Mezcal. We're gonna do a very light model on the actual rosemary, you guys. We just want to get a little bit of the flavor of it. We don't want too much, but it's gonna help a lot with the actual taste and the aroma of it. Very light. You're gonna see actually the oils of the rosemary sitting on top of the mezcal. That is a perfect moment for it. Then right after that, we're gonna go for what is called a sweet vermouth, one ounce. And obviously Campari, one ounce as well. Let's add some ice. And let's give it a really good spin. So the process of the spinning is actually really good in your cocktails. You're chilling and integrating all the actual liqueurs on it, but also you are doing what is called the burning, the actual uh, cocktail, which is basically melting the ice and just smoothing the flavor of all the ingredients. Whew, this smells amazing. Let's get a really nice, cute glass and a couple baby spheres. Straight to double, double strain. Yeah. And we're gonna proceed with the garnishing. The rosemary. You wanna look fancy? You can touch it for a little bit. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, the rosemary, mezcal, negroni.